Atlas Client has been updated to the latest version of MCPE and today I'm going to show you how to get it. So we want to head over to their official website atlasclient.net that is going to be linked down in the description below. Here you want to view on, click on view downloads um, and then you'll notice the download Atlas Client button right over here and that's automatically going to start the downloads. Just save it to your downloads. Now here as you can see in my downloads I have Atlas Client so we want to simply click on that and then click on install. Now Atlas Client has been installed successfully and we can open it up. That is going to actually automatically open up Minecraft uh, with Atlas Client. So as you can see right at the bottom down there in a very uh, non-obtrusive little font it says Atlas Client which is obviously great. Uh, not sure why this is my skin, but anyways, to use Atlas Client, I have actually already made a full in-depth tutorial. Uh, that will be linked down in the description below for the ones of you who want it. For right now, I'm just going to show you guys how to get started. So to start off using this, you want to head over to the pause menu over here, then click on this button that says Atlas Client Settings. Once you're here, you can click on the Client Settings button, and that is going to bring you to their main Click GUI. This contains all of the utilities that Atlas Client has. As you can see, I'm scrolling through here. There is quite a lot of them. Uh, to enable them, you can simply turn them on just like this, and to disable them, click on them once again like that. Anyways, for the rest, if you click on their general area, then you'll be brought to their customization menus. As you can see, these are actually quite large and they contain a bunch of customization you can apply to these utilities as well as a little description at the top over here with what um, the, the, util the utility, in this case, Armor HUD, actually does. Uh, for the rest, it should be pretty self-explanatory, pretty easy to use. If you're looking for something, then you can search for it right up there. Uh, anyways, for the rest, some of these utilities are going to be things that show up on your screen. Your coordinates, for example, turning this on is going to show my coordinates. So as you can see, I can now view my coordinates up there. If you don't like the location where it is or want to change it, you can head back into the pause menu over here, Atlas Client Settings. And then in this menu over here, uh, we actually have access to the HUD editor where we can drag around all of our HUD elements to anywhere we want. And as a bonus, as you can see, it has grid snap, which is obviously absolutely fantastic, especially because we're on MCPE over here. Anyways, finally for the rest, this client also actually supports profiles over here. You can create profiles. Um, however you want and what these are going to do is they're going to save all of the customizations that you have set in here and then you can create different profiles for different scenarios and the like anyways for right now that was basically that if you have any questions or to like do of course feel free to leave those down in the comments below remember to subscribe if you like content like this and uh, remember that there is also an in-depth tutorial in the description anyways for right now thank you ever so much for watching and i do of course hope to see you again in the next one Bye-bye.